Hello, welcome to the next podcast of Andy Collier Talks Cricket Memorabilia. Um, this week um, we're going to do a little bit on Morris Leyland. Um, a few of his bits and pieces have come up on uh, eBay in the last week, so uh, fortunate enough to get one item and uh, the other one's going all the way off to Australia, so uh, we'll have a look at that. But first, just congratulate uh, um, Bill Bailey on uh, Strictly Come Dancing last night for winning. He fortunately took my place, so he's a very lucky boy. I was injured pre-season, so I couldn't make it, unfortunately. So, sorry, OG, you'll have to wait for another year. I'm better now, so should be all right. So, um, onwards and upwards. So, anyway, on to the uh, uh, Morris Leyland items. First one, this one is uh, was used by Morris, come down through the family. This is signed by the uh, 1936 side to Australia, and the side that um, played in the first test match on there is some quite nice signatures you've got Robinson and uh, Sievers um, and also got Tommy Wade there on the uh, 1936 side and to go with that you've got a this is a nice photograph this is already my collection which is a 1936 side to Australia um, nice uh, image that one see uh, Morris Lay in there uh, that's a nice image so I'm pleased with that one so that's uh, very nice. But uh, my purchase from Morris's lot was um, this beautiful signed 1928 photograph. Was uh, Morris Lane's copy. All the signatures there except for Staples, who unfortunately um, went home very early on with a severe attack of lumbago. I do have a photograph uh, from the first uh, match of the series um, with Staples on. Uh, signature on rather, but um, I'm rather pleased with that. That's a great, great buy. That one, uh, I've got quite a bit of 1928 stuff, so that's uh, fitted in rather nicely. So, we're going on to uh, just sticking on that 1936 theme there for a minute. Some of you might have collected the cards that was uh, Morris Leyland on photo cards number 169. That one, so that's uh, a few in the group. And Morris, he played for Yorkshire from 1920 to 1947, um, scoring uh, 30 to, over 32,000 runs with 2,764 of those in test matches, in his 41 test matches. Um, going on quite a few tours, uh, first one to India as an emergency, um, and then his last one was uh, to um, the West Indies with uh, Yorkshire. So he's uh, been around in the cricket world. So we'll carry on with another couple of bits. Just staying on that 1936 side. There's a nice uh, tour program there from uh, the uh, SS Orion 1936 7. All the images in there. Uh, where's Morris? There's Morris there. Look. That's uh, quite a nice little uh, bit there. His first tour to, or his tour to South Africa 1930 31. There's a program from 1930 31 there. Which is quite a nice one. They went off on uh, Edinburgh Castle from Southampton. There's a signed uh, player signing on the back there, so that's quite a nice. There's Morris just there. So uh, quite a nice, uh, rarish item that. Um, unfortunately, just falling little pieces a little bit, uh, but I suppose 90 years old, we're all going to be doing that. So going to the 1928 tour now. Back to 1928. Uh, there's a. That's a final. Uh, tour program from the tour, which was on the Almondy, Armis Almondy, captain by L.V. James. Um, and on there was uh, there's another copy of the team photograph there. So it's got the itinerary and everything else on there and all the results. So that's quite a nice uh, final program of the tour. A great tour, which we won 4-1. Um, and then I've shown this before, I think, this one, but this is... Uh, Another menu, and uh, this was given to captain of uh, the Ormondy, L.V. James, um, signed by Morris just up here, and all the others on there. Got Wally Hammond there signing Wally, which is uh, quite a rare signature, I'm told, by the Gloucestershire Storts. And this one was a complimentary dinner, a victory of the uh, of this picture in the Ashes, and each one had a little, uh, little verse of a song they all sang at dinner, so it's obviously quite a good evening that. That's quite a treasured, uh, treasured uh, um, program or menu. That one. I've got a ball that was in the last, used in the last um, 
match against an Australian eleven upstairs, but uh, I've got to bring that one down. And then uh, we got um, this is the ship, the uh, Ormondy or Almond, whichever way you want to pronounce it. It's a signed copy there. That's on the way back. They went out on the Ontis. Or Trento rather, shall I say? So that's quite a nice uh, image, that one. And the 1936 side, they went out on the uh, Orion. One of its first voyages, actually, the uh, 1935 MCC side went on the Orion's maiden voyage. So that's uh, quite a nice uh, signed copy there of the uh, Orion. So we also went on the very famous body line tour. Morris, and there's a nice uh, photograph there of the body line tour. I've um, seen that image quite a few times. This is actually out of a newspaper, the Illustrated Sporting and Dramatic News. That's a genuine page from there from uh, 1932. So that's quite a nice image. I've, I managed to find a nice uh, frame in an antique shop for that, so it uh, goes quite well, that one. And of course, you've got the uh, this lovely photograph here of the ship that took the uh, team to Australia in 1932, which is quite a rare copy. It's also got a 1948 one in it as well, so I'm particularly pleased with this uh, copy. Um, that's uh, quite a rare thing, that is, so I'm very pleased with that. So, uh, so uh, we're very pleased with our bits and pieces. The back, to say, is uh, it's just making a pit stop here at my house and uh, I'm sending it off to Australia to a great collector in Australia so I'm pretty sure he's going to enjoy that um, what with the rare signatures on there so um, I hope you've enjoyed this one from the uh, from just highlighting Maurice Leyland and some of the tours he went on so uh, hopefully we'll uh, have a good Christmas other than that we're, uh, um, we've got into serious lockdown now from last night so um, obviously uh, we just have to make do with some of my collection now, I'm afraid. It's going to be virtually impossible to get out to uh, go to other people. So um, I'll do my best to keep you entertained. And I'll see you on the next one. Happy Christmas anyway. Cheers.